What is up guys? Here it is. The new Fortnite Battle Royale starter pack is live and I just recently purchased it and I really love the skin. This is one of the best skins out there. It's worth a buy. I only have two skins right now and it's the free PS Plus one and this one. And I don't really need too much skins. Maybe I'll purchase the Battle Pass in the future. For now, I'm gonna be using this skin because I really love it. It's my favorite skin right now. And for the price, you know, what could go wrong? Uh, you also get a new bling called the Catalyst. So I have that one equipped. And uh, luckily, I did win a game. You know, you'll see uh, the end of this gameplay here. But, uh, you know, it's live right now. And I suggest every person who doesn't have a skin, if you have PS Plus, you get a free skin. But you really need to get this because it's a really good price. It's totally worth it. It's available on PS4, Xbox One, PC, and iOS. And I think it's $4.99 US. I'm not sure. But I think it is. And it's called the Rogue Agent skin. It's an all black version of the starting skin. And yeah, there's a little bit more armor on the arms, which it says in this article. And yeah, that's that's just what I purchased today. And you also get 600 V-Bucks, which is great if you want to spend that on something else or you want to save up when you level up to a new tier and then you get more V-Bucks you can save up for something else. And yeah, luckily I did have at least 10 bucks remaining in, on my uh, PSN account. so. And I was able to buy that one and yeah, that's not the only news I have for you today guys I also have new Call of Duty World War 2 news Call of Duty World War 2 just announced their new DLC DLC map pack 2 which is called the War Machine it comes with the map Dunkirk and also Egypt and V2 and it also comes with a new operation mode map called Operation Husky Lastly, the new Nazi Zombies map, the Shadow Throne. Uh, it looks pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie that when I was looking at the photos of the maps, they look pretty interesting, they look like pretty good maps to me, at least. I, I think anything is better than the World War II standard maps. And yeah, I, might, I don't know if I'm gonna buy this one because I haven't bought it, Call of Duty DSC since Black Ops 2, so yeah, it's been a crazy long time. So uh, I have to make a very smart decision about this. I just gotta check how it looks. It's just a, see a bit of gameplays on YouTube and see if I will purchase this but yeah those are the news I have for you guys a lot of people were expecting a Modern Warfare 2 remaster trailer today but actually it can come out anytime this week because he didn't say an exact date the guy from Activision you no know, it could happen because they have to release a trailer before that game releases I mean the game was released in April 30th uh, I've seen placeholders for that date and you know they gotta release something now because I've been waiting too long I'm really stoked about this. I really hope to see a multiplayer. I don't think that is happening, but you never know. There's still a possibility. I'll be surprised. And yeah, I'll, I will, you know, probably record my reaction if I do see a Mobile for 2 remaster trailer. But yeah, that's about it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to leave any suggestions down in the comments below, feel free to. If you want to see me play some Fortnite live or maybe Call of Duty World 2. That'd be great. If you guys have any tips for me to make my videos better, just leave it down below. I'm always open to new things. And yeah, guys, it's Tempest HQ, and I'll see you guys in the next one.